This is Jordan Tower with JT News. Make sure you touch that like button, touch that subscribe button, ring that bell so you can stay informed of what's going on. And I hope you guys are having a great day. Let's get right into it. So we got a little baby, did like 130, something like that the first week on his album. Um, a lot of people were liking the album. He's doing a lot of freestyles and stuff. He's doing a great job. He's really like, he's been good since he started, but he keeps getting better and better and better, which is great. He's one of the top artists in Atlanta right now. And he's on the label QC, as we know. Now, uh, there's this rumor going around that him and Offset have a problem with each other and that something happened between Offset's crew and his crew and they got into it. And people are wondering if there's a problem with Little Baby and just everybody at QC, maybe, you know, or just maybe with Amigos. Well, he fueled this more by not having anybody from QC on his album. Nobody. Like, and uh, Charlemagne made sure he brought that up at the Breakfast Club. Um, and he said, you know, damn, that's crazy. I don't have anybody on my album <laughs> from QC. Like, you didn't know that. <laughs> he has Gunna on there, 42 Doug. Now, if you have 42 Doug on there from Detroit, I don't know if he's, I don't think 42 Doug's one of the biggest artists in Detroit. He's one of, he signed a Gotti. And he's definitely got a buzz out there, but he's not bigger than uh, I swear Vezo or people like that to me. But uh, or I, you know, obviously uh, the other artists that are you know popping out there. But anyways, uh, then he has Future on there. Gonna you know Little Wayne, Little Uzi Vert, Moneybag Yo, Young Thug. Now he seems tighter with Young Thug than anybody at QC. Um, Oh, I meant to say the other artist, T Grizzly out of Detroit. But um, say so, so he and then he has nobody from QC, not one person. He always said Young Thug's the first person to really believe in him and give him game. Um, but yeah, we'll have to see what happens with this. This is uh, something's definitely up. They obviously don't like each other anymore for some reason. Then, unfortunately, we got Max O'Cream. His brother passed away. Somebody broke in his apartment and took his life yesterday. That's crazy. Um, in Woodlands, California. Um, there, He's out of Richmond, uh, and I'm pretty sure Max O'Cream's from Houston. Uh, I don't know if he's right outside of Houston, but... Uh, oh, yeah. Okay, so his brother's from Richmond. So they're probably both from Richmond, but that's just outside of Houston. Um, who knows what this is coming from but uh let's see they wouldn't say the victim went outside before returning declaring that he had been popped and then leading to the victim's roommate to call 911 so he had a roommate okay so and they're searching for surveillance and other evidence but this is crazy man uh so my condolences go to him and his family uh maxo cream signed to rock nation um and really successful in the underground but anyways i appreciate you guys and uh i hope you guys stay safe out there appreciate you guys so much and i will check you on the next video don't forget to hit that like button hit that subscribe button i'll check you on the next one peace